Let's learn. Mape. Music. Arts. Physical education. And health. Good day, my grade 6 pupils of our Pili Elementary School. I am your teacher, Nen, your Mapi 6 teacher. And now, let's talk about arts. Our topic for today is all about parts and function of the camera. Are you excited? Let's try and looking back our previous video. So let's answer this one. What principle of arts are applied? In the picture number one. Very good. That is balance. How about picture number two? Yes, that is contrast. Nakita ninyo na asilay kalaina na ay dark and light. So nagcontrast sila. How about number three? Yes, that is emphasis. No, na emphasize ra ang color nga red tulips. How about number four? Yes, that is pattern or rhythm. How about number five? Very good. That is unity. Amazing answer. And now, for number six to number ten, let's try if your answer is correct. It's all about photography. Write yes on the blank if the statement about photography is true and no if it is not. Number six. In photography, the elements and principles of arts are also applied. Yes or no? Yes. Na applied siya. Number seven. The output will depend on the type of camera you use. It is yes or no. What is your answer? Very good. That is yes. That we depended yun at siya sa kung unsa ang type sa atong camera nga gigamit. Right? How about number eight? It needs a skilled photographer to capture a good photo. It is yes or no? Yes! Very good! How about number 9? A good camera will always produce good pictures. It is yes or no? No! Nagdepende yun na sa photographer kung unsa niya pag-capture o nindot bang iyang pag-capture sa iyang hanggi picture no? How about number 10? Contrast and harmony are also applied in photography. It is yes or no? Very good! The answer is yes! Understanding the elements and principles of art will make you capture a good scene around you, right? Remember that photography is not just about taking photos. It is also about applying or using the elements and principles of art. In photography, a camera is an important tool. Kabalo ba mo, Ana? Camera choice depends on what the camera can do and the abilities and the interests of the photographer. Each type of camera is different from another. Yes, the advantage of one camera can be disadvantage of another. And now, we have here the brief introduction of a digital camera. There are 10 basic camera parts in today's digital world. Whether you have a digital compact, or 
digital SLR. These parts can be found on most camera. Nakita ba ninyo no? Kantong mga, DS, uh, mga SLR camera. So, naa siya mga 10 basic camera parts. So, excited na ba mong makibalo? Yes! And now, here are the parts and functions of a camera. First, we have here the lens. Lens serves as the eye of the camera. The light enters through the lens. This is where the photo process begins. Look at the picture. So, mauna ang gitawag nato nga lens. Number two, the viewfinder. The viewfinder, this is the main visual source of image taking. Kanabitong nakita na to sa koan niya? Nga ni capture na to? Yan, mag-click din ta? Okay, diha. Number three, the body. The main portion of the camera. It can be a number of different shapes and sizes. Look at this picture. So, mauna, yahang body ang lawas. Okay, number four, the shutter release. Shutter release, this is the button to press when capturing an image. Mauna, i-click na to para makapture na to ang image. So, nakita ninyo na? Yes! Okay, number five is the memory card. Memory card, it stores all the the image information ranges in size and speed capacity. So, ana na to i-save tanan kay kung grabe na no, bug up na kaayo ang ato ang na-save. So, pwede na to ibutang sa ato ang memory card para masulod tanan ang atong gipang capture. Example. Okay, nakakita na ba mo, Ana? Yes, that is memory Cards, isudra na siya sa ato ang camera. And number six, the LCD screen. LCD screen found at the back of the body. Naasiya sa luyo sa alawa sa camera. And can vary in size. It is mainly for viewing photos after shooting but some cameras do have a live mode as well. No, naapo na sila yung mga live mode ang some cameras. Kung kato ng mga nindot, siguro ka ng mga cameras, no? Okay. So, this is the LCD screen. Sa so, kakita naman na ninyo, no? Kay balo na mo unsa ng LCD screen. How about number 7? It is the flash or flash allows the camera to shoot even the low light condition. So, pwede rin na niyang butangan ng flash kung ngit-ngit na ba, no? Example, dim na or dark na ang lugar na to. Ito nang butangan flash para mahayagan siya. So, nakita ba na ninyo? That flash, kanang na-circle lang, ano mo, na ito ang gitawag nga flash. Okay. How about number 8? So, number 8 is the user controls. User controls is the control on each camera will vary depending on the model and type. It may only have auto settings that can be used for different environments or numerous controls for auto and manual shooting along with custom settings. So, naa na siya. Ato na siya mag is i kuan na nato kanang i settings nato ang nindot ba ang iyahang pag capture nato or ato ba nang i i blurry ang ato ang palibot nga kita ra ang maka focus no pwede sad na siya so ato na siyang i customize ang atong settings okay and now we have here the digital photography Digital photography is popular nowadays since more people are taking more photos than ever before, right? Sa unang panahon, dili pa yun kaayu uso 
ang magpa-picture, no? Niya ang sa una pag yun ang picture, murag black and white pa. Dili pa ma-emphasize ang iyang color, no? So, hanap pag yun kaayo. Karun, we are in digital world. So, makita na to na ajoy kalainan. So, grabe na jud, no? Popular na karun ang pag-picture. Okay, digital photography is a very convenient way to take and store pictures, right? There are two primary devices which can use in digital photography. Sakto ba? Yes, sakto kaayo. Okay, nakakita ba mo ana nga picture? Unsa man na? Very good, ash ash. That is mobile phone. Naa ba ta ana? Yes. Kay naa jud ta ana no kay ato nang gigamit. How about this one? Yes, that is the digital camera. So usa pud na sa mga devices to capture images. Pwede na to magamit ang mobile phone and also the digital camera. Sakto ba? Yes. Para masabtan kung unsa ang atong gipang discuss about the parts and functions of the camera, we need to answer this exercise number one. So in exercise number one, you choose the letter of the correct answer. Okay, number one, it stores all the image information. This ranges in size and speed capacity. Joseph James, what is your answer? Very good. Memory card. Diha na to storage ang mga images, no? Gipang save na to. Okay, for number two. This found at the back of the body and can vary in size. It mainly for viewing photos after shooting. And then what is your answer? Naasiya sa luyo. Makita. Very good. The answer is LCD screen. And number three. This is the main visual source for image taking. What is your answer? A. Viewfinder. B. Shutter release. C. Body. Or D. Memory card. Yes. The view. Finder. Number four, it allows the camera to shoot even in low light condition. Okay, unsa man to siya? A. Flush, B. Battery chamber, C. Monitor screen, or letter D. Function settings. Yes, the answer is letter A. Flush. Okay, number five. The mechanism that releases the shutter and therefore enables the ability to capture the image. A. The LCD screen. B. User controls. C. Shutter release. Or letter D. Lens. And what is your answer? Very good. The answer is letter B. The user controls. And for your assessment, no? Okay, so what part of me or what part of the camera? Label the parts of the camera. Write your answer on your paper or notebook. So nakita man to na to ang mga parts sa camera. So isulat ninyo sa inyong papel kung unsa na sila. Oh, ang mga na-label diha. No? Unsa na siya for number one. Okay, number two, number three, number four, and number five. So, inigumanin niyo yung answer. So, gibalik na nako. Inyo ning isense ako ang messenger. Okay, para ma-check ni ma'am. Okay, for number six, this button is pressed to take picture. So, asa man diha? Okay, number seven. 
This is where you frame the image you want to capture. Number eight, this focuses the image seen at close or far ranges. Number nine, this allows photography in low light condition. And number 10, this lap houses the removable storage card. Okay, unsa may mga answer, Anna? Send this on my messenger, right? Okay, and that's all. See you next time!